Um, I could have been a drug dealer. I could have been the average rapper. I could have been the average basketball player. Um, Shakespeare definitely brought me in the right direction. Um, my cousin actually passed away from a uh, shooting not too long ago, actually. Um, it, it was ridiculous. Uh, he was gunned down and whatnot, and um, I definitely did not, once I seen that, that definitely was my wake-up call. Shakespeare's um, led me out of that. And now I have my agent going, I have good things going for me, and um, I don't plan on going back. Definitely Shakespeare's has helped me and leading me out of the average hood. And so you can see them going from a complete lack of comprehension to absolute understanding. Yeah. To, as if, you know, the light bulb goes off and there's a moment where they say, oh, I get it, that's what that means, that's what those words mean. Is this dagger which I see before me the handle toward my hand? Come let the clutch thee, I have thee not, and yet I still see thee. Again, it gave me that structure that I needed. Uh, coming from the neighborhood that I came from was really, really rough. Shootings, raids, gang members, and drugs. Really didn't want to be a part of that. Spectacles on nose and a pouch on side. His youthful house hold will save a world. Give it me, for I am slow of study. <laughs> you may do it some plotting, for it is nothing but roaring. <laughs> let me play the line too. I'll roar that let any man's heart get to hear me. I'll roar that let the dude say, let him roar again. Let him roar again. <laughs> Letting the matter slip. What, what do you think that might mean? I'll not meddle with him. Aye, but he will not now be pacified. I mean, Fabian can scarce hold him yonder. Plague aunt. And I, I thought he had been so violent and so cunning at fence. I'd seen him damned ear. I'll challenge him. I'm Brian Chu, and I heard about your experience when I was just 13 years old. All these years later, I find myself in an incredible position. Uh, I'm currently studying biomedical engineering at Ryerson University. I'm in my second year now, and this experience has given me all of the tools that I find many of my peers lack. In any job, in any field, you need to be able to communicate, you need to have discipline, and you need to have a presence when you're talking to other people. There's no job that's all by yourself, and if there's anything that teaches you teamwork, it's your experience. What you're doing is very good, because what you're doing is you're making kind of a road map of where you want to go, and you've got to know as the character and as the actor, right? You want to say, okay, this is my road map, I'm going to start here, and I'm, I know the character's trying to get down there. Yeah. Once you know that map, and then you start going, well, okay, so how do I get there? Right? How, do I, how do I drive through and how do I actually get to that kind of place? The best, without, without a doubt, the best four weeks of my life. I, I learned so much about myself, about Shakespeare, about people, about life, everything, really. It opened up so many new doors for me. Thank you. Thank you, Shakespeareans. And I tell you, in all honesty, there's not a single day where I do not use it. There's not a single day where I do not practice Shakespeare and use it to my advantage. And to see these kids on the cusp of that discovery, that here is something that will be a, a useful template and resource for them for life, extraordinary.